forever ago. Um, I think uh, he has a few family members that went to school with him. Like, the nigga lived like two blocks away. But anyway, I digress. Let me update you with a few things that's going on. Please. Remember Adam Calhoun? That mm-hmm. rapper who was sue whooping his video and was talking crap and sending a bunch of subliminals my way. Uh, it was beefing. Uh, had a little fake drama with Ryan Up Church. You remember that guy? Talking about the dude that had a uh, log out eight video. Who? Talking about the day that made that edit long video. No, no, hell no, no, no. That's his daddy. That's his dad. dad. <laughs> the one that that he was hugging. The one that was hugging him from behind. Okay. When he was pregnant, that nigga. Um, he he put out a country album recently. I hope it does good. Wow. Right. Uh, one of the songs that got exposed that his new song was an old country song from like a year ago that he just put his verses on. I was like, this is my country. With him not even singing. It's someone else's song. What do you think about that? Do you think that's original? Think it's okay? Think that that's a front? Remember, this whole country thing was supposed to be his big new, like, I guess, jump into something that he really wanted to do. He's leaving hip hop and doing country because it's what he felt, but he can't even make the damn country song himself. What do you feel about that? That, that I mean, he got going on. He need to do what he needs to do to. Do you agree with it? You think it's authentic? Or do you think that that kind of is like being inauthentic? Like, if you sign up for a boxing match, would you, sh- should I show up and box for you? Would you think that that's doing what you have to do? Or? <clears throat> First of all, I sign up for boxing. Know what I'm going to do. After so if you making an album, I don't, I don't need I don't need nobody to fight for me for nothing. So with you doing a country album and trying to prove everybody wrong, you think it's okay <clears throat> for you to use old songs from someone else yeah, and just put your shit in? Gotta do what Usher did. He's on my contagion. I don't know what that means. Better go digging. Go cheat on his girlfriend or something to do something and make get a hit. <laughs> How did we get to that? He's, you said he need help with his country album, so I'm saying I'm that's not what I said at all. As well, that's what you telling you me. Took, uh, that's, yeah. what I, that's that's what that's that's what I'm that Your response was that he needs to cheat on his girlfriend. I don't understand. That I get it. That's, that's how that's how Usher did it. He cheated on what's her name, and then he had a hit album. No, no, that's a common misconception. The Confessions album was based on Jermaine, Jermaine Dupri. Him and John T. Austin were the writers of that, not Usher. Oh, damn. All those situations were based on Jermaine Dupri's situations of stuff of him sneaking in cribs and out the windows and all this extra shit. It had nothing well, to do with you, Usher. Well, you, well, you, well, you should have made Jermaine Dupri to sign them goddamn songs over. Why would he do He, he made millions. But anyway... Do you, nigga, just say, nigga, say whatever you feel. I don't even, nigga, say, what do you feel about that? If that's how you feel, cool. But yeah, say more opinion, though, than sing. Well. You just think it is what it is? Like, yeah. If you're going to do something, I tell myself and I tell, I do and I show, I prove. Nigga, work, nigga. Okay. You don't have to put a, uh, uh, What's the name on the um um what's the name for a uh, help? You're supposed to do with your damn self. Just like what I'm doing. Only thing he's doing is do this, do that. I gotta do it. Yeah, somebody like, asked that too. Somebody said I think since you you the boxer BXB, you should fight for your brother whenever you had to. He's a boxer too. In fact, he's currently doing the boxing thing. So, nah, I shouldn't be able to box. I get what you mean. Though. I get what you mean. But nah, he should be able to go in the ring and box himself. I think it's being lazy. <clears throat> I think, especially after th- dropping that first record and no one liking it, then you go and ride a bull and fall on your neck, <laughs> nigga. And then got the nerve to name the album the second rodeo with a picture of you riding on the bull before you fell. No, 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 nigga. That was the first one, and you failed miserably, nigga. 
That shit was a marketing campaign and you got knocked the fuck out. The cover should have been you on the floor with the, the bull over you like it happened in real life. But yes, for me personally, <laughs> um, I could get like collabing and working with people. What is this nigga doing? What is he what is what is he doing? What, what happened? I was just reading something. I thought I was tripping. I'm like, what just happened? <laughs> I thought something went broke or something. What are you? This nigga anywhere. I think that I mean, there's nothing wrong with collabing, right? Or like working with other people, but then when you just blatantly just hijack someone's song and put your verses on it and tell us this is my country album. <clears throat> that's lazy. Oh, that's a Drake. Hey Drake. Elaborate. Drake steal niggas bars. Elaborate. Uh, you see how Drake take niggas bars from old songs and put them on new songs? Elaborate. So now he took an old song and put his voice on all his lyrics. So it's basically Drake based just reversed. Yes, no, I don't think. I, I feel like it's Give a Drake. me an example of Drake doing that. He took some lyric and made something new? Like what? Nah, uh. <clears throat> When, when uh, Meek Mill was dropping an album, Drake had took the bars from the 80s rapper and used it on Meek Mill's album. So the dude is using, you said it's supposed to be a country song. I mean, country oh, album. Nah, supposed, I'm, to be a, supposed to be a country album. No, no, no. That's that's supposed to be your country was, album. If you Something frown totally upon different. what Drake did, then that means you, you should frown upon what Adam Cajon did because it was 10 times worse. No, that's what I'm saying. It's not bro. the same thing. Adam Cowan did worse. I, I'm, I'm, I'm saying what Drake did is like everybody do it in rap. Everyone does that. Jay-Z now, did it a thousand times. But now here's what I'm saying. Not anybody. Here's, here's what I'm saying. You're making an album, bro. This is your album, your creativity. This is where it is. This is you. Now, I will not want like to have somebody's music, somebody else's music on my joint. Unless I took like a beat from it or it probably a set, like a piece. I'm not going to take the whole song from somebody and then put my lyrics on. Nah, fuck I don't it. think the Drake joint would be as intense. But see, right? Drake, see, I, 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 got, I can stand Drake. I can. OK. All right. Cool. Because it's rap. That's what rap is. Now, bro, this is an album we're talking about. Your album. Yeah, that's different. Like line, taking a line and turning it into something or flipping it. Nigga, this sounds like nigga. I got a song with me singing, and for like four bars, I use Jay Z lines because it just sounded cool. And if anybody got a problem with that, those same lines were sampled from Luther Vandross. So like, I don't have a problem with someone using a line or two as long as you're paying homage to the person. That's Cassidy. I'm a hustler. I'm a, I'm a hustler, homie. See, so if you got a problem with Drake, then you got to have a problem with Cassidy. But that nigga did it multiple times, nigga. Oh yeah. You fucked up the game. Who was the with other one on the second album? The other Cassidy record? I'm a hustler. I'm a hustler. And he had another one. Uh, he even said, he said, Sean made it a hot bar. I made it a hot song. Drink that, in my two-step. That's what it was. I got my drink in my two-step. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a sample it's too, on, nigga. It's on, it's on, and I'm That's on. a sample too, bro. Bro. That, 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 that's like a sample, right? Uh, even what's the other one? Ti, Ti got a record like that. Bring him out. That's a sample of Jay Z. Bring him out. Bring him out. It's hard to yell when the barrels in my city. Bring him out. Bring. It. That was hard. That was a hard record. But like, yeah, I don't think that that's a big deal. I think that that Adam got home took it to the next one. Now it's it's like this. Tip also was saying that he just touched down from prison. In that after that song, but what that guy could do, hey, I ain't got nothing to do with nothing. I'm just saying, like, <laughs> he did, after he was doing the song, plus he was beating with Lil Flip, too. So, uh, what that got to do with anything? The song wasn't the song was this little flip, too. In that, that, that song, he probably got a line in there for sure. They actually pissed for it before. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, that day, that song also was this and Lil Flip in there, too. Probably, he was this little flip in that song. Too. I just thought that song was fire. Somebody said, I need to lend. You my glasses. Hey, we both can't see in this <laughs> I'm just as blind as him. That's how I didn't know what he was over there looking at. I'm like, is something right nigga? Oh my god. Did it freeze, man? Um, but yeah, we both blind. I'm just as blind as him. Like 
It's for Seth, but for me, the further I am, I can see it better. No, see, it's not that. I read slow as shit, so that's why I'm like this, so I can read. It's crazy. I don't give a fuck. I'm talking you truth. respond slow, too. <laughs> 30 minutes later. <laughs> hey, I'm playing a video game. My, wife, my wife hates that shit. This nigga, 30 minutes later, I'm like, nigga, yeah, I'm I asked uh-huh. you that. Yeah, whatever. This nigga would respond to a question I asked him 30 minutes ago, the sign. That shit, I, mean, I was like, what the fuck are you talking about? Wait a minute, are you, you responding to what I asked you like 30 minutes ago? Yeah, I'm like, oh, this nigga's crazy. I forgot I even asked you that, nigga. You zoned out, I was just like, all right, what? <laughs> like, all right, nigga, do your thing. Is my uh, response twenty minutes later? Like, oh yeah, and I'm like Nick, what are you talking about? But anyway, oh, let me tell you this thing. 